The U.S. Army recently awarded Wisconsin-based company Oshkosh Defense a $6.7 billion contract to manufacture the highly anticipated Joint Light Tactical Vehicle, commonly known as JLTV. Oshkosh Defense defeated competitors Lockheed Martin and AM General, with Lockheed protesting the award recently. During the contract, Oshkosh expects to deliver an estimated 17,000 vehicles in the first three years of low-rate initial production, and a total of 49,100 for the Army and 5,500 for the Marine Corps in five years of full-rate production. The JLTV will replace the military standard Humvee, which has been in operation from the 1989 invasion of Panama to the Afghanistan and Iraq wars. The Army has sought a Humvee replacement that is as mobile but offers the same protection as an MRAP, a mine-resistant ambush-protected vehicle. According to Alcoa, the JLTV incorporates some of the best ideas aluminum has to offer. The aluminum-intensive, lightweight JLTV is expected to transform the ground vehicles industry, boasting advantages over the Humvee in payload performance and protection. The sleek 42mm Apple Watch that millions are wearing may not be as sleek with bumps or scratches covering it. Perhaps that's what Kickstarter-funded company Lunatic took into account when they developed Epic, an aluminum case and band that is a reliable alternative to Apple's official bands, which range from a $50 rubber one to a nearly $500 stainless steel option. According to Zendesk, Lunatic's rugged case consists of 6,000 series aircraft-grade aluminum with stainless steel crown, button, screws, and mesh screens. The band's material is made of leather with suede-lined interior, and there are nine slots, so the band adjusts to wrist size and is secured with a wide aluminum post. With protection and style in mind, the Lunatic Epic aluminum case and band is lightweight, adding only about 36 grams of weight. While it is slightly bulky, it is not heavy given its aluminum structure. For Aluminum Channel, I'm Emily Collins, and thanks for watching.